Hello, welcome. In this short video, let us look at an example illustrating the computation of a four point DFT using the DIT FFT algorithm. So, given the signal x of n equal to 2 power n for values of n equal to 0, 1, 2, and 3. So, for these four values, we have x of n. Our goal is to find x of k for values of k from 0 to 3. So, that is our goal. So, the values of x of n are x of 0 is equal to 1, x of 1 is equal to 2, x of 2 is equal to 4, and x of 3 is equal to 8. So, these are the four values 1, 2, 4, 8. Now, our goal is to find, it, find the DFT of this sequence. So, for this purpose, we are going to use the butterfly diagram of the four point DFT uh, using the DIT FFT algorithm. So, we are given the values x of 0, x of 2, x of 1 and x of 3. That means, we have 1, 2, 4, 8. So, this will be equal to 1, this will be equal to 4, this one will be equal to 2 and this one is 8. So, we are given these four values. Now, the output of the first stage will be that is f1 of 0 will be equal to uh, x of 0 plus x of 2. That is, it should be equal to 5. And then, f1 of 1 will be equal to x of 0 minus x of 2 that means it is equal to minus 3 and then f2 of 0 is x of 1 plus x of 3 that means it is equal to 10 and finally f2 of 1 f2 of 1 is uh, difference between x of 1 and x of 3 that is 2 minus 8 that is equal to minus 6. So, the input to the next stage that is the value here will be equal to uh, was minus 6 into w4 power 1. So, it should be equal to 6j, the value here. That means, the value w4 power 1 into f2 of 1 is 6j. So, let us uh, summarize the values at the first stage. That is, f1 of 0 is equal to 5, f1 of 1 is equal to minus 3, f2 of 0 is equal to 10, and then w4 power 1 into f2 of 1 that is the input to the next stage is equal to 6j. So, these are the values at the at the inputs of the stage 2. Now, let us go to the next stage that is uh, we have to compute the uh, DFT values. So, x of 0 is by definition equal to f1 of 0 plus f2 of 0. So, that is 5 plus 10 equal to 15 and then x of 1 is the uh, f1 of 1 plus w41 into f2 of 1. So, it should be equal to minus 3 and then plus 6j and x of 2 is f2 of 0 that is it is f1 of 0 minus f2 of 0. So, 5 minus 10 it is equal to minus and finally, x of 3 is f1 of 1 f1 of 1 minus w41 f1 of 1 that means, it is equal to the conjugate of x of 1. So, minus 3 minus 6j. Uh, so, therefore, for the final output is x of 0 is equal to 15, x of 1 is equal to minus 3 plus 6j and x of 2 is equal to minus 5 and x of 3 is equal to minus 3 minus 6 j. So, to summarize, uh, we have uh, used the DIT FFT algorithm for finding the four point DFT of a given signal x of n is equal to 2 power n for values of n equal to 0 to 3. So, uh, we use the butterfly diagram for doing the computation. So, the outputs at the stage 1 that is f1 of 0, f1 of 1, f2 of 0 and f2 of 1 are given uh, based on the butterfly diagram. Uh, the values are 5, minus 3, 10 and minus 6 and then the inputs to the next stage are 5, minus 3, 10 and 6j because of w41. It is a weight to uh, multiply to the f2 of 1. Now, the in the second stage that is the final outputs are basically x of 0 is 15, x of 1 is minus 3 plus 6j, x of 2 is minus 5, x of 3 is minus 3 minus 6j. Thanks for watching.